So Vasca should give us something for rescuing that kid. And, uh... No, wait, there's more fucking salamander at the logging camp. Fucking this salamander gang is everywhere. I don't think the war on fist tech will ever end. Yeah, right fucking there. There they are. You dare challenge the Salamandra. I totally do. Mess with me and die. The one guy's on fire and he's shit talking me. Careful now. Mess with me and die. There. Liberated brig makers. Nothing Hello. Thanks be to the lords. You're free. We wish to reward you. What is Salamandra doing in the swamp? They're based at the former non-humans camp. You'd need an army to drive them out. Thanks. I'll remember that. So I did that backwards. But I got some orange out of the deal. So a light sword, light club, some more orange. Okay, it's not too shabby. Hmm. I should talk to Vasca. Deal. I haven't really made much progress in this chapter. There was the bank robbery, which was a, a big mix-up. And, uh, and then I just killed some salamander guys. Those kickamores are fucking massive. Oh, look at- oh shit, you're way too big. See you later. See you later. There we are, we're here. We're back at the village. Holy shit, they're still chasing me. Holy fuck, he's killing everybody. Just kill it with fire. There we go. Can I loot you fucking guys yet? Nope. Oh, look at him. He's sleeping. Here, I'll tuck it out from the monsters. I hear you, fella. I hear that. What? I found the child. I found your missing child. I thank you, White Wolf. He's hard to understand. It has been said. Whosoever understands the Lords will be solitary among the crowd, for their thoughts flow like the deep waters. So he's supposed to be that way. From a drowned woman born, he shall lead those who walk the Lords' path to the underwater kingdom. I'm glad to help. What? I freed all the brickmakers. They confirmed Salamandra's evil deeds. I thank you for your bravery. If you are to destroy the bandits, seek the Hierophant in the grove. The druids are watching Salamandra. Oh. I'll do that. 
I know how best to reward you. Hmm? I bestow upon you the Water Lord's blessing. You may bathe in the holy waters of the swamp and rejoice. I feel truly honored for for who is greater than the Water Lords. Oh. There's some sweet shit there I should probably take. Probably something in my inventory I can eat. Hmm. 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 I have too much bottled water. Goodbye. Hymns of Madness and Despair. An occult tome about dormant underwater gods. I tell you, when the sleeper awakens, dawn will come for the children of the deep. I tell you, it is I. I am the doom of the world. I am its hope. The unjust walk a straight path. My paths are unknown. The lips of the unjust are caked with filth. I am the cleansing. The unjust bow before false lords and will be tramped into the ground. For who is above the lords? Adds entries to the bestiary and ingredients. That's weird. Dagon. Oh, shit. Dagon secretions. That's gross. Dagon, holy shit. Dagon is a mythical creature. According to the legend, it rests at the bottom of a lake near the village of Murky Waters. Dagon is a deity, so he cannot be killed. The creature receives energy from its believer's faith, which might be its only weakness. Tactics, when Dagon ventures out on land, destruction follows him. Alchemy, according to ancient legend, Dragon, Dagon, uh, Dagon secretions. That is not dead, which can eternal lie. And with strange eons, even death may die. Powers older than humanity slumber in the depths where no sun rays disturb them. Gods and demons sleep in underwater cities awaiting their time, and it is said that when the hour comes, they will awaken and bring annihilation to the world. One of those creatures, Dagon, rests at the bottom of the lake and is worshipped by Vaginoian lunatics. Dagon is an embodiment of strength and fury, and when he comes ashore, he becomes destruction incarnate. Forbidden books like the Hymns of Madness and Despair describe the ways to summon him, for he can only be called to a place dedicated to him. Well, that's going to suck later. You ever seen the movie Dagon? I personally haven't, but it's it's an okay movie, I hear. Am I going the right way? We're getting to my favorite part of the swamp. The giant impassable bushes. Oh look, giant kickamores. I'll have to waste some of my money soon on a book about Kickamores. Oh look, another Kickamore. Can't loot in combat. Oh, yeah, you came to join the party, I see. Don't mind me. I think I may have actually already spoken with the druids about Salamandra, but I can't remember. Let's celebrate with some cool, refreshing verbena flowers. Nope, there's another one. I think I'll do an inventory of my alchemy ingredients back in time, because I have a lot of shit that I can't make potions with for some reason. Elder Druid. What is it? Uh, trade? I've already read this. It's the hero fan. There you are. Yes. Bandits have appeared in the swamp. The trees told me you slew every last one. We are very grateful, Wolf. What do you think of the Scoyatel? I'm uninterested in political conflicts. The druids prevail because we possess nothing that kings covet. They, in turn, know we pose no threat to their power. They may disapprove of you sheltering Scoyatel. We help all those in need as long as they respect our customs. The elves respect and understand nature. And humans do not. Not all, sadly. Rivers near cities are befouled with waste. 
Once great forests are logged without restraint. Animals that once thrived have become scarce. I see. Yes. That was a rather empty conversation. Farewell. Um... Does that deal with all my investigations? Business with the werewolf. Uh, no, we're in chapter 3, that's why. Werewolf, I'm realized what the scoyotel... Da, da, da. I need to complete my investigation in the temple quarter and the swamp. Lubardin asks me to infiltrate the local salamander cells. I can pursue that only once I've completed my investigation in the temple quarter and the swamp. I should find some of salamander's documents in both places. Uh, arch spores, not in a huge rush to do that. Kickamore claws, the quest can only be completed at the beast here. It contains an entry about kickamores. I should give the ring to my employer in the dike. And there's some business in the sewer grate. Wait, what the fuck was that? Tamaria? What? What is this map? Interesting. Didn't mean to take my sword out, though. Um... Hello? Location. There we go. Never knew about that. You learn something new every day. White Myrtle. Some fool's Parsley. Nope. Careful. It's a lot of kickamores. Some drowners. Nature's loser. The old face stab at the end always undoes them. I think you're a little bit faster with your sword out. It's hard to tell. Yeah, I want to say I run faster with it out. Yeah, that guy woke up. Good. Because he wasn't dead. That's the story we're going to go with. I would like to go Give back to the to town. Time. I wouldn't. Yep, see you later. Desperate merchant, or as I call him, Mitchell McMeal ticket. Witcher! I've been to the swamp. I may have recovered your family ring. Many thanks. Here is your reward. Farewell. Family ring given to Desperate Merchant. Witcher! Farewell. Okay. Leveled up again. Holy shit. This is a good chapter for leveling up. And a barrel? There's a torch inside that I don't want. It's not as cool. City guard, city guard. Let's go find that dwarf merchant in the temple quarter and sell the shit we looted. Yeah, it's always raining in Tamaria, I know. Zion Schmartz. I think that's the dentist. I think that's why that sounds familiar. 
blacksmith's house. Have a, having a whetstone fight? I'll out sharpen you. No, I'll out sharpen you. What do you need? Show me your wares. I cannot. You don't come recommended, and we only serve our own and friend. What? See ya. What did this? We were fucking buddies like an hour ago. What is this? Need something? Will you sell me your- I only serve friends and those who come recommended. Farewell. I'm getting out of here. We are friends. Where the fuck's Vivendi? Vivaldi, sorry. Vivendi, I believe, is the company that publishes for Bethesda. Oh, look at this. It's my fucking pal. Welcome, Wolf. Greetings. You made it back unscathed. And the Valdi got his bank back. Or will soon. Good to hear. Did anyone give you any problems? No. And that's strange. I'm under the impression that someone is protecting you. And I don't mean the gods. I don't know who'd want to. Did you want something, Wolf? Yaven, do you really believe you can win? Do you think I want to get killed? I wouldn't risk my life in weeks of torture for mere amusement. And that's what awaits me if I'm caught. Clearly. To be frank, Gerald, any concession gained, even the tiniest right, would be a victory. Somehow the process must begin, and I'd rather see it happen now. See you later. Okay. I'm still confused how he's allowed to get his bank back after we fucking robbed it. What brings you here? Oh yeah, fucking one in a bank robbery, fair and square. I hope you recover your assets. That bank has belonged to my family for ages. And now some human. You call this justice? Goodbye. Goodbye. Hello, hello. This place lacks the beauty that normally surrounds my people. Probably. Um. Back to the city sewer. Oh boy. Figure out where this big grate goes to. It is that big thing. Well, that should be easy enough to get to. Fucking drowner's always in my way. I'm not in the mood. Oh look, a door that I can't open because there's drowners. Oh, there's a lot of you guys. Take this. Got you. Get your pal over here. And uh, this guy came to join the party too. Whoops, don't have enough for Igni yet. Just let me loot you there, fella. Got more drowner brains than I know what to do with. Look at all these bodies. Alright, I have to have this fucking key. Yes. Oh shit. It's those guys with the two swords. 
They're coming. Just fucking... Let's not be in the middle of a fight just yet. 